four weeks later, with the first stage of construction almost complete, a consignment of windows for the first floor arrives on site. Paul and the crew will spend the rest of the day fitting them. Downstairs, the new extension is in place, clad in pale brick and pointed with an even paler mortar specified by Dermot. At least that was the plan. When he was here the last day, he said he wanted a cream mortar, so we went ahead and got the cream mortar, but he turned a bit of a speed wobble the other day. He's seen a picture, but uh, the mortar was wet at the time, so I think he's going to be happy when he comes down anyway. So, well, they're up now anyway, so they'll have to stay. Do you like the colour of the brick? Yes, we like the colour of the brick. The brick is great. I'll tell you what I'm looking at, though. Is that mortar? How long has that been drying? It's not all a full week yet. Well, it's after raining today, so it's... Tipperary cream, to be precise. So I think it's a lovely colour, and everyone has come in, has ad admired it, like, but Dermot has just a little bee in his bonnet now, so we'll have to get over his bonnet. The mortar was supposed to be lighter than the brick. Yeah, it's a cream, it's a cream mortar. Yeah, so it should be kind of very light, isn't it? Yeah. That looks brown, and that's been drying out for a week. Now, that's been drying out for a week. I don't believe that's going to go lighter than the brick. No, definitely it's cream. 100%? 100%. Because you know what's going to happen if it's not? Well. Gone. <laughs> <laughs> Off which is all. They're up now and they're staying up. Do you know that that's what I'm looking for? It's cream. I'm... See, I'm not too up to date on my creams. That's the new part of the building. That is the thing that is now going to start to turn this from the big ugly house to what hopefully will sit nicer into the landscape. That brick is crucial and I am not accepting anything less than a chalky, milky, creamy white.